Gemini, welcome. This is your uh, Gemini season. I want to say thank you, Gemini, for coming in. For you guys, it's going to be different. You can choose any amount of crystal. You have to listen when your birthday, in which week your birthday comes up, and uh, you can choose. Okay, so the first week is the week of the rose. So if you were born the 21st, until the 27th, this is going to be telling you about your career, your money moving forward, and this is going to be good. And why it's going to be good is that you have the Nine of Swords in reverse. And this energy of the Nine of Swords is that there was a lot of this honesty that was transpiring around you, Gemini's at the workplace. It's as if people were basically... um using you okay people were um using you in the sense of whenever the nine of swords is a um um, um mars in gemini's and this energy of mars in gemini is that uh, you could be fired or you could be removed for your position because of uh, some sort of a uh, lies and this deceptiveness okay so some sort of a lies and deceptiveness could have moved you gemini's from your position it's as if people um collaborated okay it could have been um people were on your work computer and you get in some sort of a problem gemini's and this is going to be transpiring and you're going to become re recognizing that your work computer was either ah and then you get in the problem okay and it's as if someone was on your work computer, a Gemini's, that was creating a whole lot of problems for you. So some of you could be fired because of uh, um, someone who had a vendetta against you, Gemini, at, at your work computer and was on um, the company uh, website and was creating a whole lot of issues for you and then... The company is going to be recognizing and firing you, Gemini's, on the false uh, false pretend because um the company um uh, you know should have recognized that you weren't you were not aware of this, okay? And they're going to be firing you because of uh, it could be a situation that your partner is in some sort of a network and group. You work in some sort of an organization, and your partner and their friends and people have placed some sort of a um, hab on your computer uh, spyware and was accessing your company also with it and you're going to be getting fired and you know it's a horrible situation because but, but you're going to be coming out and finding out in this week what has happened what has transpired and how this person have created this problem for you a lot of you gemini's were born between the 21st and the 27 you were dealing with some horrible horrible um undesirable thing that people were working against you and you're going to be getting out of this in this year so this new year is going to be bringing you out of some orbit this was like cruelty people were like very cruel um to you gemini's extremely cruel to you gemini's for no reason at all um they you know you could have they could have asked you to do something you said no and then um they start to create chaos for you um, in the in the corporation and the corporation is now going to be recognizing that some of you Gemini's were treated unfair people have done you some real wrong and they are going to be either taking you out of that department and is going to be relocating it setting up a new division for you Gemini because they recognize they don't want to lose you you have the potential so this year is going to be a year that is going to be helping you gemini in your career climbing the ladder and is going to be um also creating money for you then we have the energy of uh, um um the m um, the in the second week the week of uh, the 28th until the third you have the people who were born the week of the 28th until the third of june you have the energy of seeing the light, okay? And it's as if everything, um, you know, focus-wise and that sort of a thing is you're clear. You're clear with your work, your business, your creativity, your activities, whatever business you do, whether you're a writer and um, whether you're a painter, whether you're, you, uh, um, are, you know, whatever you do, you're going to be having a clear 
thoughts is going to be here for you and you're going to be seeing things much clearly a lot of you especially managers you're going to be recognizing why certain flow certain process weren't working because um, as a manager you're going to be recognizing the on um, desirable situation that was happening and transpiring and you're going to be finding a way of resolving these problems and these issues so um you know it is going to be wonderful there is no question about it i see um that it is going to be uh, um extremely good so you know don't do not uh, um do not um really do not um um try to create um as if oh my god you know something it is good it is good whatever is coming up for work and career for you in this year it is going to be very good because it's as if some of you could ask for um to you know to take on a new position or a very high position and you're going to be second thinking there is no reason to second think yes go for it as we look at the people who were born the fourth until the tenth, we see some sort of a disappointment. Some sort of a disappointment is going to be coming up um, for the people that was born the fourth of June until the tenth of June. Whatever this disappointment is in this year, um, it has to do with the five of cups, and the energy of the five of cups is always about Saturn in Leo. And I see some of you are, are very disappointed, disappointed in a Leo. Is this Leo your supervisor, your manager, or um, a co-worker, or an employee? You're going to be disappointed in this person because you're going to be recognizing that this person has been having and pulling a hole over your eyes for a very long time, which was, uh, um, you know, very uncalled for. You know, this person has uh, created so much issues and chaos, and you always try to get this person out of it but not is not recognizing that this person was not coming from a good place and you recognize you know this is undesirable this is an undesirable situation because um you know i, I took this person on i give this person um some sort of a start and this person i've turned around and uh, create this huge issue that now um, I could be losing my job for this. So it is a situation where it could have been an employee that you gave a position. You, you know, you kind of see and trying to give this person some sort of a, a position, pushing them up the ladder. But yet still this person has done something that creates some sort of a disappointment for you. Um, and not seeing it, it can be that some of you could be fired and it has something to do with a Leo or a Leo that you took on is going to be fired and they're going to be recognizing what this Leo have done and it is going to be costing some of you your jobs okay so be aware of this um people who were born the um the um the 4th of June until the 10th of June because this is going to be affecting you and it has something to do with a Leo and I see a disaster between you and a Leo that is going to be coming up and transpiring because the Saturn in Leo and they're going to be firing a Leo for what they have done so um when we um see this um energy that is coming up with this these are like serious energy then we look at uh, um um yeah Mars in Cancer a lot of you are going to be dealing with a cancer also and uh, whoever this cancer is they're going to be firing this cancer so is this cancer working in your department or where you are a supervisor to this person or this person was an employee or a co-worker they're definitely going to be firing this person because they recognize what this person how this person could have created some sort of a chaos so it's two persons you're dealing with how they could have created some sort of a chaos and by creating this chaos i see that um, they are going to be um, fired for this. So um, it is a situation that is happening to you on the work floor where this this uh, Leo and this Cancer um, is going to be creating a whole lot of problems um, for you, Geminis, that is going to be creating a whole lot of disappointment in this year. And because of these people, um, you could be losing your job or they are going to be losing their job because they're going to be fired for something that they have done. So it is a wonderful um, 
a situation that you're going to be recognizing and it is a year that you have to deal with pe these people it could be two co-workers a leon a cancer that is going to be creating a lot of chaos for you um whether you are in the same department or you're in different departments so be aware of this now we are looking at the people who were born the 11th until the 20th the 11th until the 20th and what is happening and transpiring is that uh, um, for you guys, you want you guys wanted some sort of a new career start or some sort of a new position in a corporation institution, and it's not going to be coming in. And the problem why is because people are now going to be recognizing um, that uh, some of you could have uh, moved further up in the ladder, but there was someone that was blocking uh, you from moving further up in the ladder, and I see that. And um, people are now going to be recognizing who this person is and what this person did to block you than moving further up in the ladder. They're going to be recognizing that someone has placed a stumbling block in your way um, in order for you not to, to not to receive some sort of a promotion that was open for you. And you weren't even aware of this. Uh, and um, it's because of someone put some sort of a blockage on your name or some sort of a disturbance situation um, for you not to get this uh, um, new um, um, new situation moving forward. So it's going to be a serious, serious situation because they're going to be recognizing whoever this person is had created a whole lot of... Uh, this illusion for you Geminis and you Geminis um that was born um the eleventh until uh the twentieth of uh, um of June you're going to be not getting a new start and it it can be something that you have done or corrosed with someone with all the people that is coming back up to affect you uh, in this timeline. So you got to be aware of what is happening in Transpire. You got to be aware that um, there were people who were co in for you not to get some sort of a new start and some sort of a new position. And they're going to be finding out about this. And this is it. Um, they're going to be finding out about it or you're going to be finding out about it that people, a lot of people had uh, some sort of a uh, uh, it could it is is a form of uh, something that some of you Gemini has done in the past is going to be serving for you not to get the start in the future. So it is a sad situation, but guess what it is? You have the right to, to look at how you can resolve this situation by choosing one of the symbol. Your symbol is um the symbol of the ring, but you can choose any other symbol also. Um, to see how you can resolve this situation and that uh, the energies change because uh, these readings are a time, time, timeless, but also these reading things can change because um, by choosing one of the crystal or two of the crystal, the crystal that is above your energy, your week, and another crystal, you can figure out how to resolve this situation. So nothing is placed in stone, okay? A lot of people... Uh, psychic people said, yes, this is what is going to happen. And then something else happened because you make a change. Okay. You um, decide not to go one way and go the other way. And this is why some people say, oh, psychic people, not all psychic people are good. But what they don't tell you is that at the moment, at the moment, at the moment that you're listening to something, at the moment that you're in something, you're doing something, that's the focus. But if you get an advice or two, and this is why I say to people, choose one of the symbol, then you change what is happening in your life and it comes out. That's why I'm not a psychic or anything. I am just a channeler that show you what is going to be coming up. And I give you different, different ways of accessing this situation, different, different ways of accessing this situation in order for you to reach your goal. I gotta go. I do love you guys. Namaste. Until next time.